Hey guys, Iron Toast here, and we're going to talk about the easy way to beat Annihilus in this month's event quest. Alright guys, in this month's event quest, it's Annihilus at the boss, the, actually the second time you fight him in the epic difficulty. And anytime you see that node where they just gain physical and energy resist, that's time for Ronin. So whenever I go in with Ronin, I usually bring Heimdall, just for that uh, death cheat. And then, as far as this guy in particular is concerned, your main thing is to get uh, probably three combos in there, and then you can start reeling off your special ones. After you're there, it's beatdown mode. Now you'll notice at the beginning of this fight that you kind of use the same trick you use on Domino, right? You can dash back once. I find that if you dash back once and then try to counterattack, or three times, I find three times is actually a little bit better. Um, then you can go in for yours or if you're really good at intercepting just try to intercept and get your three combos in now If you use Heimdall <clears throat> sometimes that can be tough to intercept. I know I mess it up all the time if you um, If you use Heimdall to cheat death, then you can actually beef it once right you can get you can take your You can take your licks, but you can become unstoppable for a moment and get your third combo so that way you only have to successfully do it twice so um, if you have Heimdall, I would definitely throw him in there. It makes it a lot easier. It does take away from your team to get through the rest of the quest. Well, for me it does because I only have a 4 star. Um, and then of course you have to have your Ronin. I use, um, I use a 3 star Ronin the Barbarian because, uh, his ability is maxed out. It really, it really cranks up that, uh, stun duration. Um, I have a 4 star that's duped, but it's, it's a low level. And so I actually find the 3 star to be a little bit better. So... Um, this is pretty much it. Anytime you see that node where they get physical and, and energy resistance just by getting hit, Ronin, guys. Easy, easy, easy. So that's just about it. I will make a video here soon on uh, the Human Torch. He's actually a little trickier, um, especially as a boss because he's got extra buffs and stuff like that. But And that is pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. See you guys later. Bye.